Hey there gamers, welcome back to SimTuber, where we dive into the latest and greatest in gaming. Today we're talking about a brand new Marvel Rivals game. If you're a fan of Overwatch and Marvel superheroes, then buckle up, because this game might just be your next obsession. Marvel Rivals has just went into another beta period. I was given a invite code. So in this video, you're going to be seeing in the background, there's going to be gameplay for me playing Marvel Rivals. Whether you're dishing out damage with Iron Man, healing your team as Doctor Strange, or tanking hits as the Hulk, there's a hero for every playstyle. But it's not just about the characters. The core mechanics of Marvel Rivals feel very similar if you've played Overwatch. It's a team-based shooter where strategy and coordination are key. Objectives, payloads, and control points. It's all here. The game also features fast-paced action, colorful graphics, and those satisfying ultimate abilities we all love. And just like Overwatch Marvel Rivals is incredibly fun if you've got a good team. And that brings us to our next point. Here's the deal. Marvel Rivals heavily relies on teamwork. If you and your team are in sync, strategizing, and communicating well, you're going to have a blast. But if you're not, things can go south pretty quickly. The game's design encourages cooperation, and trying to go solo can be a frustrating experience. It's not enough to have a few good players, everyone needs to pull their weight. So if you're diving into Marvel Rivals, make sure you're ready to work together. And that's my biggest gripe with this game because it's in a beta period right now. So you only get one invite code. So at max, you're playing with one other friend. So it's two of y'all on a team of six, and even with only two even with two people out of six working together you're not gonna have the greatest time playing this game unless you get matched up with another great team that's like the other four people on your team are just working out Stanley together the game design encourages cooperation uh, in conclusion, Marvel Rivals is a thrilling new addition to team-based shooter genre. Got the charm of Marvel superheroes, the strategic depth of Overwatch, and the potential for endless fun. As long as you've got the right team, so grab your friends, assemble your squad, and jump into the action. If you got some friends that ended up getting a beta code, make sure you, when they hit level 6, make sure you ask them, see if they can send you a beta code. Maybe y'all, two of y'all can get into a game. Maybe... Three of y'all got beta codes each and then y'all invite three other people and y'all can actually have a good squad and play and enjoy the beta. I'm enjoying it. Even though it's largely team-based, I enjoy it. It's got a little depth to it, like learning how to, for Black Panther, for example, you have to chain his moves so you can actually maximize his skills and stuff and actually win in fights because he only has 250 health. So that's like three hits, maybe. If you get hit with three moves, pretty much you're like dead. So if you're not chaining his moves and you're not using him effectively, then you're not going to have a good time with Black Panther. But he is one of the higher challenging characters to actually learn to play. But I like to learn the higher challenging characters like him, Spider-Man, Venom's on the higher tier. Magneto's pretty super easy to use. Loki's a super hard one to use, but like he's got hella good skills. You can transform into other heroes on the other team and you can copy their abilities. You can use almost every hero as Loki. So this game has some depth and it's definitely gonna be a banger and this could for sure take over Overwatch's spot, especially with Overwatch being on downfall and how it hasn't really been handled as good as it should have as an IP. But um, I'm enjoying it. I'm gonna get back into some gaming sessions on it. I'm also trying to play around with Tekken with Lydia, new character release. I'm trying to learn her and everything and get back into Tekken. I uh, gotta keep up my, um, my Tekken King rank and all that. Try to get her Tekken King and above. Got a destruction with her at least. So I'm doing all that and trying to play this while I have a week's worth of time to play this during the beta period. I think it's till like it's the fifth. But thanks for watching. See me tuber everybody. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more gaming content. Let us know in the comments who's your favorite Marvel Rivals heroes. And until next time, game on. See me tuber out. Peace.